Ergodic theory, Greek, egon ergon, work, odos hodos, way, is a branch of mathematics that studies dynamical systems with an invariant measure and related problems. Its initial development was motivated by problems of statistical physics. A central concern of ergodic theory is the behavior of a dynamical system when it is allowed to run for a long time. The first result in this direction is the Poincaré recurrence theorem, which claims that almost all points in any subset of the phase space eventually revisit the set. More precise information is provided by various ergodic theorems which assert that, under certain conditions, the time average of a function along the trajectories exists almost everywhere and is related to the space average. Two of the most important theorems are those of Birkhoff and von Neumann which assert the existence of a time average along each trajectory. For the special class of ergodic systems, this time average is the same for almost all initial points, statistically speaking, the system that evolves for a long time, forgets its initial state. Stronger properties, such as mixing and equidistribution, have also been extensively studied. The problem of metric classification of systems is another important part of the abstract ergodic theory. An outstanding role in ergodic theory and its applications to stochastic processes is played by the various notions of entropy for dynamical systems. The concepts of ergodicity and the ergodic hypothesis are central to applications of ergodic theory. The underlying idea is that for certain systems the time average of their properties is equal to the average over the entire space. Applications of ergodic theory to other parts of mathematics usually involve establishing ergodicity properties for systems of special kind. In geometry, methods of ergodic theory have been used to study the geodesic flow on Riemannian manifolds, starting with the results of Eberhard Hoff for Riemann surfaces of negative curvature. Markov chains form a common context for applications in probability theory. Ergodic theory has fruitful connections with harmonic analysis, lie theory, representation theory, lattices in algebraic groups, and number theory, the theory of Diophantine approximations, L functions. Topic: <laughs> Ergodic transformations. Ergodic theory is often concerned with ergodic transformations. The intuition behind such transformations, which act on a given set, is that they do a thorough job stirring the elements of that set e.g., if the set is a quantity of hot oatmeal in a bowl, and if a spoonful of syrup is dropped into the bowl, then iterations of the inverse of an ergodic transformation of the oatmeal will not allow the syrup to remain in a local subregion of the oatmeal, but will distribute the syrup evenly throughout. At the same time, these iterations will not compress or dilate any portion of the oatmeal, they preserve the measure that is density. Here is the formal definition. Let T, xx be a measure preserving transformation on a measure space x, sigma, mu, with mu x equals 1. Then T is ergodic if for every E in sigma with T minus 1 E equals E, either mu E. Topic zero or mu E one. Topic examples An irrational rotation of the circle R, Z, T, X, X plus theta, where theta is irrational, is ergodic. This transformation has even stronger properties of unique ergodicity, minimality, and equidistribution. 
By contrast, if θ equals p, q is rational in lowest terms, then t is periodic, with period q, and thus cannot be ergodic. For any interval i of length a, 0, t q minus 1 i, which contains the image of i under any number of applications of t, is a t invariant mod 0 set that is a union of q intervals of length a, hence it has measure q a strictly between 0 and 1. Let G be a compact abelian group, μ the normalized Ha measure, and T a group automorphism of G. Let G be the Pontryagin dual group, consisting of the continuous characters of G, and T be the corresponding adjoint automorphism of G. The automorphism T is ergodic if and only if the equality T n chi. Topic chi is possible only when n zero or chi is the trivial character of G. In particular, if G is the n-dimensional torus and the automorphism T is represented by a unimodular matrix A, then T is ergodic if and only if no eigenvalue of A is a root of unity. A Bernoulli shift is ergodic. More generally, ergodicity of the shift transformation associated with a sequence of i, i, d, random variables and some more general stationary processes follows from Kolmogorov's 0-1 law. Ergodicity of a continuous dynamical system means that its trajectories spread around the phase space. A system with a compact phase space which has a non-constant first integral cannot be ergodic. This applies, in particular, to Hamiltonian systems with a first integral I functionally independent from the Hamilton function H and a compact level set X. Topic P Q H P Q E of constant energy. Liouville's theorem implies the existence of a finite invariant measure on X, but the dynamics of the system is constrained to the level sets of I on X, hence the system possesses invariant sets of positive but less than full measure. A property of continuous dynamical systems that is the opposite of ergodicity is complete integrability. Topic: Ergodic theorems. Let T x x be a measure-preserving transformation on a measure space x, sigma mu, and suppose f is a mu-integrable function, i.e. f element of L one mu. Then we define the following averages. Time average. This is defined as the average, if it exists, over iterations of t starting from some initial point x. F caret x equals lim n infinity one n k equals Zero N minus one F T K X Display style hat F X equals lim underscore N right arrow inf T frac one N sum underscore K equals zero carrot N one F T carrot K X Space average, if mu x is finite and non-zero, we can consider the space or phase average of f. F equals one mu x f d mu for a probability space mu x. 
equals 1 display style bar f equals frac 1 mu x int f d mu quad text for a probability space mu x equals 1 in general the time average and space average may be different but if the transformation is ergodic and the measure is invariant then the time average is equal to the space average almost everywhere this is the celebrated ergodic theorem, in an abstract form due to George David Birkhoff. Actually, Birkhoff's paper considers not the abstract general case but only the case of dynamical systems arising from differential equations on a smooth manifold. The equidistribution theorem is a special case of the ergodic theorem, dealing specifically with the distribution of probabilities on the unit interval. More precisely, the pointwise or strong ergodic theorem states that the limit in the definition of the time average of f exists for almost every x and that the almost everywhere defined limit function is integrable. f caret element of l 1 mu display style hat f in l caret 1 mu furthermore f caret display style hat f is t invariant that is to say f caret t equals f caret display style hat f circ t equals hat f holds almost everywhere and if mu x is finite then the normalization is the same f caret d mu equals f d mu Display style int hat f d mu equals int f d mu. In particular, if t is ergodic, then must be a constant almost everywhere, and so one has that f equals f caret display style bar f equals hat f almost everywhere. Joining the first to the last claim and assuming that mu x is finite and non-zero, one has that lim n infinity one n k equals zero n minus one f t k x equals 1 mu x f d mu Display style lim underscore n right arrow inf t frac one n sum underscore k equals zero carrot n one f t carrot k x equals frac one mu x int f d mu for almost all x, i.e. for all x except for a set of measure zero. For an ergodic transformation, the time average equals the space average almost surely. As an example, assume that the measure space x, sigma, mu models the particles of a gas as above, and let f x denote the velocity of the particle at position x. Then the pointwise ergodic theorem says that the average velocity of all particles at some given time is equal to the average velocity of one particle over time. A generalization of Birkhoff's theorem is Kingman's subadditive ergodic theorem. 
Topic probabilistic formulation Birkhoff Kinchin theorem Birkhoff Kinchin theorem let f be measurable e f lim n infinity 1 n k equals 0 n minus 1 f t k x equals the f c x display style lim underscore n right arrow inf t frac 1 n sum underscore k equals 0 caret n 1 f t caret k x equals e f mid math cal c x where e f c display style e f math Cal C is the conditional expectation given the sigma algebra C display style math cal C of invariant sets of T. Corollary pointwise ergodic theorem. In particular, if T is also ergodic, then C display style math cal C is the trivial sigma algebra, and thus with probability one. Lim N infinity one N K equals zero N minus one F T K X equals E F display style lim underscore n right arrow inf t frac one n sum underscore k equals zero caret n one f t caret k x equals E F topic mean ergodic theorem. Von Neumann's mean ergodic theorem holds in Hilbert spaces. Let U be a unitary operator on a Hilbert space H, more generally, an isometric linear operator, that is, a not necessarily surjective linear operator satisfying Ux. Topic x for all x in H, or equivalently, satisfying U asterisk U. I, but not necessarily U U asterisk. Topic I. Let P be the orthogonal projection onto psi element of H U psi. Psi equals ker i minus u. Then, for any x in H, we have lim n infinity one n n equals zero n minus one u. N x equals p x display style lim underscore n to inf t one over n sum underscore n equals zero caret n one u caret n x equals p x where the limit is with respect to the norm on H. In other words, the sequence of averages. One N N equals zero N minus one U N Display style frac one N sum underscore N equals zero carrot N one U carrot N converges to P in the strong operator topology. Indeed, it is not difficult to see that in this case any x element of H in H admits an orthogonal decomposition into parts from ker I minus U 
display style cur i u and ran i minus u display style overline operator name ran i u respectively the former part is invariant in all the partial sums as n display style n grows while for the latter part from the telescoping series one would have lim n infinity 1 n n equals 0 n minus 1 u n i minus u equals lim n infinity 1 n i minus u n equals 0 Display style lim underscore n to inf t one over n sum underscore n equals zero carrot n one u carrot n i u equals lim underscore n to inf t one over n i u carrot n equals zero. This theorem specializes to the case in which the Hilbert space H consists of L two functions on a measure space and U is an operator of the form u f x equals f t x display style u f x equals f t x where t is a measure preserving endomorphism of x thought of in applications as representing a time step of a discrete dynamical system the ergodic theorem then asserts that the average behavior of a function f over sufficiently large time scales is approximated by the orthogonal component of f which is time invariant. In another form of the mean ergodic theorem, let ut be a strongly continuous one-parameter group of unitary operators on h. Then the operator 1 t 0 t u t d t display style frac 1 t int underscore 0 caret t u underscore t dt converges in the strong operator topology as t infinity in fact, this result also extends to the case of strongly continuous one-parameter semigroup of contractive operators on a reflexive space. Remark, some intuition for the mean ergodic theorem can be developed by considering the case where complex numbers of unit length are regarded as unitary transformations on the complex plane by left multiplication. If we pick a single complex number of unit length which we think of as u, it is intuitive that its powers will fill up the circle. Since the circle is symmetric around zero, it makes sense that the averages of the powers of u will converge to zero. Also, zero is the only fixed point of u, and so the projection onto the space of fixed points must be the zero operator, which agrees with the limit just described. Topic: <laughs> Convergence of the ergodic means in the LP norms. Let x sigma mu be as above a probability space with a measure preserving transformation t, and let one p infinity. 
The conditional expectation with respect to the sub-sigma algebra sigma t of the t invariant sets is a linear projector E t of norm one of the Banach space L p x sigma mu onto its closed subspace L p x sigma t mu. The latter may also be characterized as the space of all t invariant L p functions on x. The ergodic means, as linear operators on L p x sigma mu also have unit operator norm, and as a simple consequence of the Birkhoff-Kinchin theorem, converge to the projector E t in the strong operator topology of L p if one p infinity, and in the weak operator topology if p equals infinity. More is true if one equals. Topic Sojourn time equals Let x sigma mu be a measure space such that mu x is finite and non-zero. The time spent in a measurable set A is called the sojourn time. An immediate consequence of the ergodic theorem is that, in an ergodic system, the relative measure of A is equal to the mean sojourn time mu a mu x equals 1 mu x chi a d mu equals lim n infinity 1 n k equals 0 n minus 1 chi a t K X Display style frac mu a mu x equals frac one mu x int chi underscore a d mu equals lim underscore n right arrow inf t frac one n sum underscore k equals zero carrot n one chi underscore a t carrot k x for all x except for a set of measure zero, where chi a is the indicator function of a, the occurrence times of a measurable set a is defined as the set k1, k2, k3 of times k such that t k x is in a, sorted in increasing order. The differences between consecutive occurrence times re. Topic key minus key minus one are called the recurrence times of A. Another consequence of the ergodic theorem is that the average recurrence time of A is inversely proportional to the measure of A, assuming that the initial point x is in A, so that k zero zero r one plus plus r n n mu x mu a almost surely display style frac r underscore 1 plus c d o t s plus r underscore n n right arrow frac mu x mu a quad text almost surely see almost surely that is the smaller a is the longer it takes to return to it topic ergodic flows on manifolds 
The ergodicity of the geodesic flow on compact Riemann surfaces of variable negative curvature and on compact manifolds of constant negative curvature of any dimension was proved by Eberhard Hoff in 1939, although special cases had been studied earlier, see for example, Hadamard's Billiards and Artin Billiard the relation between geodesic flows on Riemann surfaces and one-parameter subgroups on SL R was described in 1952 by S. V. Foman and I. M. Gelfand. The article on Anisov flows provides an example of ergodic flows on SL R and on Riemann surfaces of negative curvature. Much of the development described there generalizes to hyperbolic manifolds, since they can be viewed as quotients of the hyperbolic space by the action of a lattice in the semi-simple Lie group so n, 1. Ergodicity of the geodesic flow on Riemannian symmetric spaces was demonstrated by F. I. Mortner in 1957. In 1967 D. V. Anisov and Yar. G. Sinai proved ergodicity of the geodesic flow on compact manifolds of variable negative sectional curvature. A simple criterion for the ergodicity of a homogeneous flow on a homogeneous space of a semi-simple Lie group was given by Calvin C. Moore in 1966. Many of the theorems and results from this area of study are typical of rigidity theory. In the 1930s G. A. Headland proved that the horocycle flow on a compact hyperbolic surface is minimal and ergodic. Unique ergodicity of the flow was established by Hillel Fersenberg in 1972. Ratner's theorems provide a major generalization of ergodicity for unipotent flows on the homogeneous spaces of the form γ where G is a Lie group and γ is a lattice in G. In the last 20 years, there have been many works trying to find a measure classification theorem similar to Ratner's theorems but for diagonalizable actions, motivated by conjectures of Fersenberg and Margulis. An important partial result solving those conjectures with an extra assumption of positive entropy was proved by Elon Lindenstrauss, and he was awarded the Fields Medal in 2010 for this result. See also Chaos theory Ergodic hypothesis Ergodic process Lyapunov time, the time limit to the predictability of the system Maximal ergodic theorem Ornstein isomorphism theorem Statistical mechanics Symbolic dynamics Lindy effect <laughs>